Hello everyone, welcome to Newcastle Fan TV. We've got Chris, who's our international vlogger. He's going to be talking about his reaction to the defeat against Everton last Wednesday. Uh, yeah, very disappointing, obviously, the result. I feel we were in the game for, for quite lengthy parts of the game. Um, obviously, some good efforts, some good efforts on goal. Close, hit the, hit the post twice. Um, obviously, goalkeeping mistake by Darlow. I'll probably say, where's Freddie Woodman? Give him a go. At least need a solid keeper, so why not give the young bloke a go? He's had World Cup experience. He's been at under 18s, under 19s World Cup. So, plenty of opportunities. We could have won the game, so no complaints as far as effort and possibilities of winning the game. Um, the tack, John J. Shelby's tackle, seen a lot of comments on Chronicle and online about, oh, this guy's a mug, this guy, you know, shouldn't be picked. For God's sake, he was, he had to stop the counter attack. It was a 50-50 tackle, nothing wrong with that. I don't see anything wrong with that. These days in the Premier League, you can't touch anyone, you can't, you can't, a foul's not, a, a foul is not what a foul was 20 years ago or 15 years ago or even 10 years ago or five years ago it was a 50 50 tackle and i said in some comments on the facebook thread on the on the facebook page that this guy's reputation precedes him if it was another player he wouldn't have uh, been sent off very interesting that there's uh, more more rumors and a lot more information about this possible takeover and looks like there'll be some funds in January. So. I'm not going to lie, that weather outside looks absolutely glorious. It's minus four here in Newcastle. So that was Chris on his thoughts with the defeat against Everton. Here he is just recording some of the lineup against Arsenal. We all know how the Arsenal game went, yet another spirit performance from Newcastle, but another 1-0 defeat, which leaves us on at this weekend's huge game against West Ham. Keep an eye out for the build-up coming in the next couple of days.